What's up, YouTube? I'm King Shanks, and this is Droid's Finest, and I'm back with part 12 of Legna Tactica. And when I left off, it was a cliffhanger, so I'm just going to get right back into it. It'll start me off in the battle, I'm pretty sure, if I just go to continue. I don't have to read anything, it'll just be right there. That's what it did with that one video, and I missed a little bit of a storyline in that, but that's okay, because now we're getting into the... The true meat and bones of the game. Okay, so I want to just take a quick look at this battlefield. Okay, so I can go straight up that way. Or I can go around this way, take them out, and come up this way at them. I kind of want to just kill everybody on the field. That's what I like to do. I get more money and more experience that way. So, I'm going to I'm going to take the long way around. This might be a shorter video cuz I just I literally just want to get through this this part because some crazy shit's happening. So, defeat Slade. Okay, so All right. I can do that. I want to get that bag, first of all. That's the first thing I want. So I'll send her to get that. She's an archer, and she can attack from a distance, so it's, it's better to send her up that way. I think, anyways. That's my strategy. They're going to be attacking me from the front and the back and everything. So this is going to be... This isn't going to be one of the easiest battles that I'm in here. It's going to be one of the harder ones that I've gone in. That's alright. I'll kick everyone's ass. I'm a boss. I'm a, I'm a boss! It, there. Maybe I should have just held my ground and let them come to me. I don't know. No, no, no. You need to move. Move your ass. Trying to kill my archer, eh? Yeah. Teach you your lesson. Oh, they're just going to stay up on top of there, aren't they? Of course they are. Of course they are. The three that I got to kill are staying up there, huh? Alright. I'll play it. I'll play it like that. I'll play it just like that. Saint magic? I guess that's like their version of holy magic. Oh, come on. Why would you miss it such an important time? I got this. I've got this. Rogwalk. Rogwalk. I'm I'm hoping your magic can hit some stuff. 
Good. Nice. Oh no. You got healing herbs and everything. Damn it. Okay. So, I'm going to move her to there. I'm going to use random firing. Yeah, hit everybody. Fuck it. Well, it didn't hit everybody, but it hit a lot. Sorcerer's bracelet. Okay. I'll take that. Wait, now I can't tell where my enemies are. Killer Claw. Holy crap, 513? That's not bad. Okay, so I'm going to kill all these guys down here. And then I'm going to head up head upwards. Wait, where are all my enemies? No. Oh, there's one right in, right in front of me. Come on, wait. Move. Throw him right in the line of battle here. Fuck it. Oh. They're just going to keep missing, then fuck. Uh-oh. I got this. It's all under control. I'm going to use her to do that attack again. Hopefully it'll kill somebody this time. guys just don't like dying. The human guys are easy, but those goblins, man, they just, they, <coughs> they have a problem with dying. God, still not dead. Yes, please do the attack. Oh my god, do it. Why won't it do it? Oh, I'm probably not close enough. not going to help them, Kane. Okay. Oh, God, that's going to hit her. Oh, it missed her. Good. That's nice. I need to get her out of there. She's trapped. Fuck. Uh-oh. Nice. Damn it. Killed my archer. I could revive her. I don't know how many revives I have. I have four. Here. How? Oh, yeah, of course. I have to be right beside the grave to do it. Okay. That's not going to work for me.
I'm pretty sure that Miana eventually is going to have revive magic. Gotta get rid of Cain because he has he has cures. He has uh, items to cure. Oh, of course. And I want to get rid of that that uh, other guy, that prophet-looking guy. He has items to cure too. Or, no, he can just cure with magic, actually. Oh, good. I like it when everybody dies. Oh. Okay, so... I'm gonna I'm actually gonna use the revive. I've never used one yet, so I may as well just try it out. Bring her back from the dead. Wait, no, what? Move luck. Good. That's more, more like it. I gotta get rid of that fireball guy too. I guess I'll, I'll use Eevee for that, I guess. This asshole. Oh, yeah, I'm just dominating. Dominating. Nobody can fuck with me. Eh. I think it's just them three left. So it's time to get my ass in gear and go get them. Oh, come on, Lek. Don't tell me I can't make it up that little tiny ledge. Okay, good. I was gonna say, what the hell? You're still not moving. Oh, I'm gonna put her there. They're going to start moving any minute now. Let me just trying to get all of them in their general area right now. So that it's not uneven when I get into the fight with them. So I don't know how strong these guys are going to be. Oh, 
Oh, everybody's blocking the Oshawa. Oh, here we go. Now it's gonna start. Now the shit winds are stirring. I gotta kill Astar, my best friend, my brother from the orphanage. And I'm gonna kill him good. Oh. Well then. Take that, Astar. Wow, he's not that strong at all. Almost killed him in one hit. What a pussy. Uh-oh. Yeah, you go way over there. <laughs> Uh-oh, I'm out of... Okay. Well, I guess I'll heal her then. See how much slower they, they move when I'm trying to go up uphill? Nice. I like that because it has the knockback. That means they can't counterattack me, which is always a good thing. I could recover my SP with an item, I think, but I won't. Oh, that guy's kind of a douche. Well, I, I didn't kill Astar. Will he join me now? Shit, I forgot that I just needed to kill the one dude. Damn. Oh, well. Sorcerer's Bracelet. Hey, I got four revivals. Nice. It doesn't seem wise to stay around here any longer. I think it's time for us to leave. I guess so. You'll not get away, Slade. By the way, perhaps you should be getting back to your own lands. You never know, my cute little pets could be attacking Rigius Castle right now. What? Anyway, farewell. Titola, your father misses you. <laughs> Her dad's the king. What? Her dad to the king. Hey, what about us? Damn, they got away and left us here. It's gonna be bad if we get caught. They'll chop our heads off, our bodies, and display them for everyone to see. Quick, let's get out of here. We've got no choice. Come on, guys, let's get out of here. Damn. Yeah, you're working for the wrong team. What a mess. We let Slade and his gang get away so easily. And with things like this, His Highness is in real danger. Hmm. From what they said, it doesn't sound like anything's gonna happen right away. But even so... We interrogated the mercenaries. Didn't get away in time. However, they didn't know anything about where the others had escaped to. General Various. What that masked man said just then bothers me. It might be good to get back to Rigius Castle, I think. Yeah, you're right. Let's get back to Rigius Ca Castle as quick as we can. Astar? Damn. 
How did things turn out like this? I'll tell you how. So we managed to defeat the demons who were attacking Rigia's castle again. But the king of Legna is in mortal danger at the hands of the enemy. I'm worried about how much we can keep up with the soldiers' morale. Or keep the soldiers' morale up, whatever way you want to put it. The kidnapping of the king has had a great effect, there's no doubt about it. We need more fighting power. What do you mean? What do you mean? I want to rescue the queen, king as quickly as possible. However, Melissa says we don't know when the enemy is going to attack again. With things like this, we've got almost no options. We've got to stand up against Ismut and try to get His Highness back at the same time, right? To do that, we need enough fighting power to be able to keep the Ismut forces in check. If only we had that power, I guess we could find a way to get the king back. I see. But to do that, we need, as an ally, the power... Wait. But to do that, we need, as an ally, a power strong enough to, that even Ismut will be wary. The only powers I can think of right now are our allies. I guess out of them, the kingdom of Orgeal might be strong enough. Our other allies would be no match for the tribe of the Dragon of Evil. How about we send soldiers to the King of Orgeal right now and let him know what's going on? No. His soldiers in the tribe of the Dragon of Evil could be anywhere. I want to avoid sacrificing our forces in vain. Our forces are already weakened by the repeated attacks by the rebellion of the Crimson Wolf Brigade. Hey, Mian is not here. She went outside on her own a little while back. Is she trading too? Is she a trader? Astar, why? Why did you do it? Miana, it's dangerous to be out here on your own. What? Do you remember? That time when Astar was fighting with that boy in the town? No. This is the first time I've ever heard of it. Yeah, the time when some kid was making fun of us orphans and Astar gave him a good beating. Good. Fuck that guy up. That was the first time I'd ever seen Astar let his feelings show and get so angry like that. Hehe. <laughs> You were hiding behind me just like a coward, weren't you, Lek? Uh, er, maybe. That was when you first started saying you were going to get stronger and help weak people, wasn't it? Yeah, I guess it was. Oh, here we go. Come on, say that again. Yeah, so we're orphans. You got no problem with that. Eek! Astar, that... Astar, that's enough! Don't be so horrible! But they were making fun of you, Miana. They're not gonna get away with that. I'm okay, just stop, please. Look, you're even scarring... He you're even scaring Lek. Sob, sob, me on it. Well, that was a nice little flashback. Covenant principle. I see, I see. I'm glad things didn't get too bad. 
You did well to control last Armiana. I'll speak to him later. Are you going to get angry with him? Astar doesn't get violent for no reason. Perhaps he was remembering his family. His family? Like you, Miana, Astar lost his family because of the war. But he doesn't seem to be able to let it go, to let go of that memory. It all happened right in front of his eyes after all. Oh, so he's like Batman, except he turned out evil. Right in front of his eyes? What happened? Well, no, you don't need to know that. Don't let it worry you. See, and this is why I wanted to, this is why I had to do another episode, because I knew it was going to have some, like, plot thickening storyline that's going to come up, so I wanted to do this. What's the matter, Miata? Principal. Why don't we have it, moms and dads? Why are we orphans? Oh, God. Could you imagine? Could you imagine? Oh, God. Having to try to explain that to her? Well, the war's to blame for everything. Yeah, well. War? War. It's when people don't talk to each other, but try to solve problems using force to beat the other person. It's such a sad, stupid way of trying to deal with differences. True enough. Like quarreling? Yes, but in war, people living in the countries that are fighting lose their lives. Just like you, Miana, nearly everybody here in this orphanage lost their families through war. But why do people... But why do people fight like that? Well, there's a bunch of reasons I can explain, but I don't really feel like explaining all of it. They could make friends with each other. Yeah. If they talked about things. Ah, oh, Miana. The world would be so much better if everyone was as sweet and kind as you. Well, sweet and kind like you. But unfortunately, there are people in this world who don't think like you. We humans have been fighting ever since we came into being. Even these lands were created from the battle between the Dragon of Light and the Dragon of Light, Fishram, and Follic. Anyway, when you've finished your duties here, you can take a break for the rest of the day. We who are living here to make sure we have enough laughter in our lives, all those who have gone before us, for all those who have gone before us. Sleep and forget all the bad things. Make tomorrow a day with plenty of laughter. But I'm lonely. I want a mom and dad. Miana. I wish there were no wars. Oh. Oh, there's a little bit of a reason why Lek wants to stop all wars. <clears throat> Lek? Doing the voices. I don't know. I don't have voices for everybody, just the certain characters. Ah, oh, sorry, I was just thinking about old times. The times in the orphanage. Back then, I never even dreamed that things would turn out like this. But Astar's been sent far away now. I guess things will never be like before again. Hey, Miana. Back then, when Astar told us to go with him, you really wanted to go with him, didn't you? What's gonna happen to us? <laughs> What should we do? I'm... Oh, okay, so... I, I remembered reading... I 
I remember reading about this. There are decisions that you can make that will uh, affect the way the story is played. And then there's... I think there's a there's a few different endings to it too. So, uh, oh man, I want to trust Astar, but oh, oh God, this is a bad decision. What do I do? I want to trust them. I think, it, like, because it seemed like you wanted to come to his senses when I was talking to him, but if I say I'm going to trust him and then we leave and we join Ismut, and I'm attacking the people that are already with me, oh, man, I'm not going to trust him. Fuck. I'm not going to trust him. I've got no idea what Astar's thinking. I guess he doesn't really know himself. Look. That's why we've got to make Astar come to his senses. Good. Good, okay. He'll understand what we're doing, I'm sure. Hey, something wrong? He's suddenly grown up such a lot, Leck. That was a weird sentence, too. Where's that pitiful little Lek from before gone to, I wonder? That Lek's in the past now. Yeah, I done grown up. I told you I'd grow up, didn't I? <laughs> it was a joke. Thanks, Lek. Seems like I made the right choice on that. I think... I think I made the right choice anyways. I don't know. Just don't go too far away, will you? What do you mean? I'm going to be by your side forever, Miata. That's not what I meant. What's going on here? <laughs> She's just hiding, listening to the whole thing. Oh, you gave me a shock to Tola. How long were you hiding there? I never noticed anything. Are you, are you two an item? Eh? What? What? What sort of thing is that to ask all of a sudden? Uh-oh, I think Totolo wants some of the, the hot beef injection. <laughs> and no, we're absolutely not an item. I like Lek, of course I do. It's not really a question of liking or hating, though. I mean, he's a... <laughs> I mean, he's pitiful and he's a crybaby and indecisive. I worry about him. We're definitely not an item, though. If that's friendship, I'd hate to have you as an enemy, Miana. It's true, though. You're like family to me, Lek. You're just like a younger brother. Hey, you get it? You understand? Yeah, I think I get the picture. Miana likes Astar. He's my best friend. I see, no problem then. Anyway, Totola, why are you here? Did something happen? The hero's been calling for you. I came to find you. General Varius? I see. I'd better get back. Uh, let me guess. A cat fight now? I wonder what's happened. I guess we should go back too. Miana, do you really think Lex like a younger brother? Yeah, of course I do. I said so before, right? I'm glad to hear that. Lex gonna be mine, okay? Told ya! I knew she wanted that hot beef injection. <laughs> ho, 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 yeah. Give me some of that Ismood ass. Ho, ho, yeah. What? What do you mean? I thought I spoke the language of these parts pretty well. Is there something odd about my words? 
I've got feelings for luck. Wow, I wasn't expecting anything like that. You've only just met. And what's more, it's it's not right. I'll be honest, at first I was only interested in him as a subject for research. What? A subject for research? I know, right? But now things are a little different. Luck always takes care of me. I don't know how it happened, but all of a sudden, I'm full of feelings I didn't have at the start. Talk about... Talk about brazen! Do you actually know what you're saying? Why are you getting angry, Miana? Because he's like a brother to you? Well, well... In Ismut, we have a saying. Loves a sudden hurricane. Okay. I'm gonna get some of that is moody booty. <laughs> oh, hell yeah. Sorry to kept you waiting, General Virus. Did you want me for something? Yes, our tactics are basically decided, and I wanted you to hear them. This is going to be a longer video. I didn't. I, I knew there was going to be storyline to it, and it's 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 already been past a, a half hour for this one. But I mean, when RPGs get into the story, the storyline can take a while just because it needs to build a foundation for you to work with, right? We decided to go and ask for the cooperation of the Kingdom of Orgeal. We're going to suggest that our two forces work together in tactical planning and operations. Also, we're not going to rule out an invasion into Ismut. However, right now, I need to stay here and continue our surveillance of, of the area. We can't allow the morale of the soldiers here in the castle to fall any further. Yes, I completely understand what you're saying. No, you don't. You even admitted you're stupid. So I'd like to go as a messenger to Oguria Castle, Lek. Well, of course I'll do it. I'm Lek. Tell them the state of things in Legna and ask the King of Orgeal for his cooperation. Me? It's a duty with a huge amount of responsibility. I know that. I believe you're up to it, though. General Varius. Yes, sir. I understand. I'll set off at once. Sorry to have to ask you of this. Or ask this of you. Whatever. I should really provide you with some guards, but our shortage of soldiers is a real problem right now. Take Melissa, Rogwalk, and Evie with you. <clears throat> we'll do our very... Uh, we'll do our very best, Zach. I guess my knowledge is going to be needed again. I'm looking forward to it, Clack. Mess messengers to our jail. A perfect role for me. I guess I've got no choice. I'll go with you. I'm so happy to have you all with me. These three are more than enough, General Varius. I'm going to... I'll stay right by your side, Luck. Me too. Me too. I'm just like your older sister, after all. Okay, all of us together, then. I'm counting on you. Well, I'll try not to count too high. Luck, I'd like a word with you alone. We'll be outside then. Yeah, we'll be getting things prepared. We'll wait for you outside. Alright. What do you want, General Varius? What did you want to talk about, General Varius? I swear I just said that. That girl. Her name's Totola, isn't it? Yes, it is. You've not forgotten what I said before about dealing with Tatola, have you? 
Of course not. I'll take responsibility for her. Right then. What would you do if Totola turned out to be an enemy? What? As Totola herself said, she's from Ismut. If it turns out that what she's said about being pursued was a lie, and she's actually still working for Ismut, what would you do? I'm sorry, I don't quite understand. Could you take up your sword against Totola? That's what I'm asking. What? Are you saying... Are you saying I should kill Totola, General Varius? No, not at all. But if Totola is an enemy, she'll end up fighting against us. I just wanted to know whether you'd be ready to fight against her in that case. Do you... Do you sus suspect there might be something suspicious about Totola? Well, my gut feeling is that... It's unlikely she's with the enemy. However, she's hiding something. Something we don't know about. The war between the Kingdom of Legna and the Empire of Ismut is no longer in a state of deadlock. If there's anything that's even slightly suspicious, we need to be able to deal with it as swiftly as possible. Do you understand what'll happen if we don't do that? The Kingdom will be destroyed. And so many people will die. People who've done nothing wrong at all. I will do my best to make sure that doesn't happen, even if it means giving my life. I want you to be prepared too, Lek. No matter what, continue the fight for the Kingdom of Legna. And just be careful about Totola, okay? Are you called a hero, General, because you've been fighting for so long? I don't know. But I'm not so impressive, not really. I speak so confidently, but in fact, my life is full of worries. You, sir? I don't believe that. You always lead us with such confidence, General. I'm not such a wonderful person as you seem to think. I'm just playing the part, that's all. You're still a trainee, but look at me, giving you such difficult duties, telling you to be suspicious of everyone. I'm a terrible person. But take his highness. He is, he really is a wonderful person. He really doesn't spend his life thinking about what's best for the lands of Phasum. Oh wait, he really does spend his life thinking about what's best for the lands of Phasum in the kingdom of Legna. And he never thinks of himself. He's ready to do anything without hesitation if that's if it's for the sake of his kingdom. Ugh, a lot of talking. You really are devoted to the king, aren't you, General? He's he's more than worthy of my, of that devotion. People call me a hero, but he's the real hero. He's certainly a wonderful king. I hope he can I hope we can help him as quickly as possible. Yes, I hate to take things in my own hands like this, but until the king returns, I will govern this I will govern in this place. I'm sure I'll have many tasks for you, but I know you won't let me down. As far as Totola goes, I leave the decision up to you. I understand. But just listen to this. Make sure you don't push yourself too much. I'll never forgive you if you die needlessly. If that's understood, you can go. Don't let me down, Luck. More proficiency points. Gotta love proficiency points. Okay, so... I gotta go back to... Ogeria Castle, but, I'm okay, I'm just going to get to there, I'm not going to go in just yet, that's the end of this episode, I wanted to get that out of the way, because I knew after that fight there would be some huge plot line and whatever, and get us more into the game, which, and now I really am, like now, 
I'm learning more about the characters. And I was talking about that in one of the episodes earlier tonight. About how it's it really gets into the characters. And I like I, I know them. It's almost like I know them on a personal level, which is always awesome. But anyways, that's it. I'm done for tonight. When this episode airs, I don't know. Uh, I could not be done. Because I just, like you guys know, I post two videos a day or... Well, it depends, whatever. But yeah. Oh, man. Shit got real. Real, real. I'm almost ten hours into this game now. Oh, Okay. So anyways, I'm going to leave it at that. I'm going to pick it up again tomorrow, hopefully. I'm going to do some more leveling up, I think. Or, I don't know. I don't know. I might and I might not. But yeah, for now, I'm done. So stay tuned and I'll see you soon. Peace!